Happy New Year and welcome back to Chapel Hill. I hope you're rested, recharged, and ready for the start of another packed semester. We have so much to look forward to this semester, and I'd like to give you a preview of a couple opportunities that will continue to make Carolina an even stronger community. Following last November's town hall meeting on race and inclusion, I tasked a team to work with student leaders to tackle key initiatives we feel can make a difference now and in the future. We're already making progress and I'll be giving you more specific updates on our plans very soon. Next Monday is Martin Luther King Jr. Day. I hope you'll participate in some of the many events happening on campus to honor Dr. King's legacy. During my University Day speech in October, I talked about how Carolina needs to move at the speed of innovation. And innovation is happening everywhere here. TEDxUNC, hosted by students in February, is one of the many ways we embrace bold ideas and charge ahead. I hope you'll experience that inspirational day as well. In March, we will be welcoming new UNC System President Margaret Spellings. I'm really looking forward to introducing her to you into our campus, and I know she's very excited about it as well. Finally, when you go to the polls to vote on March 15th, you have an opportunity to vote on the Connect NC bond. This $2 billion bond will invest in critical facilities at all North Carolina's universities and community colleges. It is vital for our future and it will not result in any tax increases. There's so much more taking place this semester and I certainly hope to see you out and about campus at many of these activities. And until then, make every day a great day to be a Tar Heel.